Well, you know their names, you know their voices, but do you know their faces? We're here. Normally, they join us in studio back at Studio 17 Live, KGT, but today we're here in their studio. We are talking to the team here at Rewind. Thank you guys so much for having us. This is your stomping grounds. Yeah, this yeah. is it. This is where we feel most comfortable. It's a little less stressful. <laughs> <laughs> Home field advantage. Exactly. Like yeah. Exactly. So I'm here. This is this is a new game for me. Radio. Does it smell like radio? Oh, radio. Feels like <laughs> such a great <laughs> smell. <laughs> this is great. It's different. It's just basically the same. Except now you can see yeah. us a little bit. Absolutely. Well, there's a lot going on this week. Yeah. yeah. Crazy. So the the big announcement with Britney Spears, which was pretty exciting. Oh, baby, baby. Yeah, she's pregnant. Now, two concerns here. One, she's. I know you're gonna bite my head off in this. Mm. Isn't she kind of old to be getting pregnant? No. No, not at all. But she's like my age, right? She is 40 on the dot. Okay. Okay, that's, okay, that's fine. Yeah, she. I mean, she's 40 and she's been killing it, so. She looks amazing. Yeah. I wish I had half of her body. Every time I see her dancing, I'm like, oh my God, she's a six pack? <laughs> Possible. Well, you know, everybody's saying that it's such a big surprise, but I do wonder, is it that much of a surprise given the fact that, you know, at the end of her conservatorship testimony, she basically laid it out, the fact that she wanted to get married yeah. and she wanted to have a baby and she wasn't able to because she had an idea. She was prevented her. completely from her own family planning, which is awful. Absolutely, yeah. Absolutely. So it's kind of just a continuation of that free Britney. But I do also feel like we're stuck in, like, the early 2000s right now. Like, all the yeah. news that we got this week, Britney, J-Lo, and Ben, like, yeah, it came what? Full circle. Ben? Yeah. Together. Yeah. Back together again. I'm glad sometimes you meet people at the wrong time period, <laughs> right? Yeah. In your life, and then you kind of move on and then you come back and Do you feel like every relationship prepares you for the next relationship? Uh, yeah. I am so glad for the guy before me with her for her <laughs> her level of expectation to be dropped. Oh so my much. goodness. Oh, because oh, I, am, no. I am not a good looking man. <laughs> But if she finally was like, how about if he's nice and looks are lower in my priority scale? And then I stepped in. I was like, hey, look at that. You act like I was married to a model before you. But he was he was better looking. He had a full head of hair. I don't you really take a lot of stake on hair. Like <laughs> a lot of stock. <laughs> Very important to you. I like it your bald is. head. I think you I look always, weird with hair. I see people with full heads of hair and I think, damn, that looks So looks jealous. Scary. You know who else is bald? Boom. Mr. Worldwide. Oh! Oh, near, near, near. Where do you think you have that? Do the button. There it is. Yay. Yeah, I missed the 305. I've actually, I got drops from Yeah, yeah, yeah. From Pitbull. She go Pitbull. Mr. I've Pitbull. met him before. Oh, oh my know goodness. What it is. Put it down it was right when I was skinny, so people were like, you guys look alike. Not anymore. Twins. Yeah, now I kind of look like if Pitbull let himself go. <laughs> so <laughs> 20, the 29th of September, right? Yeah. Mechanics so got, Bank. Absolutely. So we've got yeah. some time to plan for that, but I think tickets go on sale here soon. The 15th, yeah. Today, yeah. yeah. So that's exciting. And I think Iggy Azalea is also supposed to go on tour with him. Yeah, I saw that. And uh, Sean Paul. Sean Paul. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Give me the light. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a lot of reggae hits, so. Yeah, oh, man. It. But it's going to be a fun concert. I'm looking forward to that. September 29th. But speaking of people that I love, since you love Pitbull, Lizzo, huge fan of Lizzo, going to be on Saturday Night Live this weekend. Host yes. and the musical guest. Double duty. And I didn't think I'd like Lizzo, but I started following her on Instagram and mm -hmm. watching her stuff. And she's amazing. She's all about body positivity, which I love. Yeah. Yes, and she plays the flute. Yeah. <laughs> right? She'll be like playing the flute and freestyle rapping and dropping. Absolutely. It's amazing. Yeah, so I'm a huge fan of her. All right, so locally, obviously, Easter is coming up this weekend. Mm -hmm. Do you guys have any big plans? You guys are mom and dad, Easter bunnies, a.k.a.? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we have some big Easter bunny plans for this week. Actually, we're bad parents. We forgot till Yeah, uh, yeah. Like yesterday? Minutes. Yeah. We're all, oh, it's it's Easter it's on Easter. Sunday. It's Easter. Yeah. Got to plan for it. So if you're late uh, planners like we are, there are some things you can go do. There's a whole bunch of churches doing Easter egg hunts. Uh, the Calvary Church is doing an Easter egg hunt. There's also some brunches. Yeah, brunch is your speed, which is really more my speed Absolutely, on Easter. Yeah. The Padres doing their annual brunch, and then there's one at the Petroleum Club as well. So you have lots of fun options, and it's probably the place the kids don't really get to go too often, so yes. it's special. Yes. Yeah. So brunch, eat up, get some candy. Some and Easter egg hunts, and you're good to go. And hopefully they pass out by uh, <laughs> 6, 7 o'clock that night. Sugar coma, nice sleep. Yeah. Love it. Yeah. All right, guys, we will see you again for another Studio 17 Live. In the meantime, make sure you spread a little sparkle on everyone's day. See ya.